Hello, ASOR friends, family, members, and donors. ASOR is excited to announce the launch of our new online visitor and member portal going live on May 24th. This platform will provide an intuitive and seamless experience for all of your online transactions with ASOR, including joining ASOR, renewing your membership, registering for events such as the annual meeting or our webinar series, donating, purchasing merchandise from our online store, and of course, accessing digital versions of ASOR's journal, all through the same online experience. To get started, you will need to set up an account through the member portal. First, you go to members.asor.org, which will take you to this login screen. From there, you will need to set up an account selecting this tab here. Now, please note that even if you have set up an account in our previous system with NetForum Pro, you will need to set up your account for the very first time you log in. You're welcome to use the same credentials, username and password that you used in the previous system, but you will have to set it up this very first time. So the first step is to add your email address, the password you would like, and your first and last name. I would also like to direct your attention to the top of this login page, where you can use either your Apple or Google credentials, your email accounts associated with those accounts, to log in. So if you prefer the social login versus adding your email address or password, you can do that. Once you have entered all the information, Click set up here at the bottom. Once you have set up your account, you'll be directed to this page where you will need to verify your email address. So the next step is to open up your email. In your email, you will find a message from membership at asor.org welcoming you to the ASOR platform. We'll click on this right here, verify, and that'll take us back to the platform and log us in. All right, so after selecting that link in your email to verify your account, you're taken back to this welcome screen. And there's just a few more steps you need to do before you're able to access the platform and really get going. The first is to enter your full name here And the reason we ask you to do this is in our old system, we sometimes have duplicate records and maybe you'll use different email addresses sometimes to access your record. Our new system will allow us to merge all that information into one record. So you won't have to worry about multiple passwords for different email addresses and different accounts. All your information is gonna be in the same place and you can log in uh, using any email address that you want that is linked to the account. So we check for existing records. We see here that my ASOR account is already created. And since I use my Gmail account, I could select this and merge the information into one record. So I just select, yes, this is me. If you come to the screen and there's names that don't match with your record, or it's the only record, it's a brand new record in the system, then you would select this one, none of the above. We select continue. And the final step is sending a verification code to that other email address, just to make sure that you're not connecting to someone else's email that isn't yours. So you select, send the verification, check your email one more time. So back in our email, we have this verification email. I just copy the code, go back to the screen, paste it. And now we should be all logged in. It may take a minute or so to finally set up the account, but here we are. Now we're at the main portal homepage.